one is a waterproof. You know what? Let me put these glasses on. Sorry if it causes some glare. Okay, this is a waterproof dog blanket. And it was $13.49. And it is, let's see. Stuck in this bag is what it is. There we go. Um, did I not just see a size on here? Okay, so yeah, this is the size. <laughs> I'm like, wait a minute, what? Okay, and so like they have a picture. Okay, so they have more sizes on the back. And it's telling you how to clean. Okay. So it's got a nifty little thing telling you it's any stick. Softness and comfort, machine washable. And let's pop it open and see what it looks like. Okay, it's an odd shape. I bet this is just more meant for, like, the seat of your sofa. But, as you can see, it's it's good length. If I held it up this way, it's taller than me. I mean, it's not quite six foot, but neither am I. <laughs> I'm mad, but no, I'm not. I am. Okay, so it's gray quilting on this side. This is the dark gray. This is like how wide it is. And this is the other side of it. You can see it has like, um, I guess that's what's going to make it stick to your sofa and maybe not slide around as your pet jumps on it and stuff. And it is 100% polyester, baby. Okay, that's one. Now, I mean, they're demonstrating for you if you need this on your couch, in your car, on your bed, just if you want to have a little space for your pet to lay and a nice little blanket or seat for them and keep the fur under control, the shedding. Okay, this one was $22.98 and it is um, dark gray, floor seat, sofa. So it's 35.4 inches by 82.8 two inches i believe and whenever i checked it in i noticed the price 22.98 and i'm thinking wow um and i just happened to look and there was a price adjustment for me so i did it and i got seven dollars and 54 cents on that one price adjustment so 22.98 minus 7.54 i will let y'all do the math because i'm busy looking for my scissors oh my goodness where are they well Let's just pretend I'm clipping it with my scissors. It's going to have run off. This one is like furry. And I'm wondering if, okay. It's this gray, dark gray color on this side. And it's got like this white piping. And it's got this, you know, that fuzzy quilting on it or whatever. And then the back is like kind of sticky. It's a tan color. And it kind of feels like the stuff they put on the rug so it won't slip. So I guess that's sort of grip your couch. And this one is taller than the other one. Oh, yeah, that's probably six and a half foot, maybe. Okay. That one feels pretty nice. I'm thinking this one would probably be better for the winter time rather than the summertime, but I wanted to get a couple all at once and make sure that I had at least something that would work. Probably should have got brown, but I got gray. I got mixed up and confused. My mom changes colors on me a lot on what she likes. Because, yeah, I do a lot of shopping for my mom. She didn't ask me to. No, she sure did not. Okay, and this one is the big Mama Gemma. It is $36.49, and it's called... 60. That sounds sturdy, y'all. And it is gray also. 102 mm, or 82 inches by 200. Nope. I, this it's not um it's it's yeah. It's hard to read what it's saying. You know what else is hard? Finding my scissors. Excuse me for one moment. They're right there. 
My trusty assistant, Koozie, did not get them for me. He's napping. But he's the only one in here with me today. And he's napping because he's a sweet, sweet boy. Okay. This one is pretty thick. Surely there's a size on here somewhere. I think this one might be actually big enough to be like cover the entire couch back seat everything yeah because this is like ooh, i'm trying not to sit on the ground this is it still folded in half so it <laughs> it's hard to hop it's hard to show y'all how big it is that's what it is Is this looking? Okay. That was my mom popping in to tell me she's going to mass. Whew. This side is, okay. It is just like a lighter gray version of the other side. So I guess that would make it reversible if you want to put it on the light side. But I think what I might do is after I put them on the sofa, on the couch, I'll try to squeeze some pictures in here and show you guys what it looks like. So you can see if it actually worked, if it actually fit, and all that jazz. And uh, I'm about to pause for just a moment, please, the dog. A couple more items to show you is we have a monocular. Um, let's see, it says that it is... Perfect for boating and yachting, sports, bird watching, auto racing, horse racing, hunting, beach, and travel. And it says, there's a warning on here, do not look directly at the sun, otherwise it will hurt your eyes. Um, monocular field of vision is infinite and wonderful. Monocular telescope, binoculars, fern glasser. Not sure what that is, but so here's what the box looks like. And it comes with a little pouch. A little instruction pamphlet. And here it is. It's pretty hefty. Like I'm kind of kind of surprised at the heft of it uh so it's got a back cap on here and then a front cap here on the front and it's got it came with a little strap for you to attach to it which i did which is just do a little loop to loo with that you know um so your some of your controls are right here you turn this and obviously you look through this part and oh my god i cannot believe you are wearing that Did you wear that to work today? <gasps> yes, I think I'm funny. So it's also got like a little uh, compass up here. I like it. I think it's pretty nice. I mean, I can't really show you how it works so well in here other than like turn this and turn this. But like, I mean, I can't put it up to you. I don't want you looking at my skin that close. Oh my goodness. You know, there's no way for me to show you how it works that way. But I did want to let you see it. So if you have any interest in bird watching or anything like that, I feel like this is a pretty nice monocular. And we have a lot of birds around here. So, and it was 948. I'm not sure if I mentioned that or not. So I'm excited to put it to use because we have lots of feathered friends, especially now that we have our new um, bird feeders and bird baths out. Okay. Now, we have a couple more items in this bag. And the first item is $11.98. And this is a cage for your phone for filming. I'm just not really sure if I want to keep it. Break it open. I'm sure they'll take it back anyway, as long as I have the uh, paper. You guys want to see what it looks like? Have you tried filming like that before? I haven't. I have a gimbal that I love. I have a couple of gimbals and uh, tripods and 
little selfie sticks with the remote control and face recognition. But I don't have anything like this. And I thought it might come in handy as I journey into my filming career. Okay, so it's got this little paper in it. Yeah. I think it wants to stay. There we go. So it's kind of showing you what it looks like. And then that kind of has a little... So see you have you can attach the light up top and then you could wait a minute that's not right you could attach this to a tripod right here maybe and there's like the microphone cold shoe thingy yeah one and no a quarter tripod treads okay well I will check that out and see what happens there uh, sorry to me to look at you like you're crazy there was a thing going across my phone and it's sideways so you guys this next I'm just taking everything out of the bag real quick to show you oh I forgot about these these were free and from one of the games or you spin a wheel or something like not a big deal free but so it comes in, but I did see these on, I think her name is Yari, on her channel. Uh, somebody else showed them too, but it's the little perfume thing. So you take the, pop the little thing off your perfume and then attach that to it and pump, 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 get you a couple sprays going. And you can even see on the side right here, it's got a little spot to see how full they are. So you could have some of your perfumes in your bag and not worry about big giant size rollerballs or whatever else for free you know you gotta love it i mean i love free stuff anyway okay this item is for it was 12.47 and it is also for filming this is to help you i can get it out Okay, so we've got a pamphlet. What's this? Stuck in the box. Okay, let a cord. Okay. We have a cord. And this little ring, which is some type of a... Uh, okay. It's the magnet that goes on here. Okay. And then, so you're going to attach your phone. And this little button is going to help you... And it came with a user manual. So I'm excited to give that a try. I will take a look at it and see if it's worth doing a little short video of this maybe to show you if it's really awesome and really cool. I will totally do that. If you don't see one, that might mean it wasn't that great. But hopefully I'll find a way to let you know what I think after I try it. Okay, this next item is $3.99, and it's a liner and lip duo, liner and lipstick duo, Cousy and Fletcher are just chilling, just hanging out, okay, so it looks like this, and this is the color. like duo 01 and so here is the pin I always put that in the most awkward position don't I I'll get better guys I promise I also need to stop showing y'all the top of my head all the time okay so this is the lipstick and I mean, really, I think I have this. This is what I have on, I think. There's your colors. It's pretty. I like it. It's light. It's a uh, velvety. I think it does say something about velvety in here. 
waterproof and long lasting lip liner plus velvet matte crayon lipstick from face secrets okay and let me see i think we have oh we have one more item you guys i think when i ordered these i think i thought i was getting nails bam baby that's toenails for a dollar 49 so you can get your little mani petty too awesome have y'all gotten toenails from Timo before this was a straight up accident on my i mean they're cute as heck but like i totally i thought i was getting fingernails so that's gonna be fun and exciting to try out okay guys that wraps it up for our haul today and i'm gonna get all this area cleaned up and start filming the next one because you know i got some more stuff to show you so please like this video if you found it entertaining or you enjoyed any of this Feel free to let me know anything that you enjoyed or if you have any questions about anything, please. I would love to answer your questions. I'd love for you to come by and say hi. And thanks for watching. Love from Louisiana. You guys have a good one. See you later. Bye. We have a visitor in the rain. He's trying to figure out what am I doing? Good morning!